please make sure you check out our friends at PlayAsia, the number one site for Japanese games and merchandise. For a game as popular as Final Fantasy VIII, it's surprising that more people don't know about the changes we're about to discuss. And by changes, we of course mean the censorship that was made to the game when bringing it over from Japan. It's unknown why most of these alterations were made, but important to bring up is the fact that the title was given a teen rating here in America and an equally high rating everywhere else in the world, so it's unlikely that changes were made due to rating related reasons. First things first, let's bring up a case of censorship a lot of you are probably already familiar with. When using the devour command, which is an ability that allows you to literally eat your opponent, a tongue-in-cheek censored please stand by message will appear on the screen over various soothing photos obscuring the action. Just to confirm, no, nothing has actually been censored here. The command is exactly the same in the Japanese version and it's just been added for humor. Now that that's out of the way though, here's all the stuff that actually was censored. Many players were probably shocked the first time they saw Squall's face getting sliced up in the opening cinematic. After all, prior to this, the series had been relatively tame when it came to violence. But a bit of blood is in no way out of place for a teen rated game, right? Well, one of the pre-rendered backgrounds in the final dungeon actually had blood severely altered in comparison to his Japanese original. Inside the armory section of Ultimacia's castle is a sword sticking out of the top right of the wall, with a vast amount of some kind of green ooze dripping from beneath it. In Japan, on the other hand, it's not some fictional green liquid, but red blood. More censorship to blood can be seen with the boss Gero Gero. This zombie-like creature will emerge once you do enough damage to the fake president. Outside of Japan, though, all of its internal organs are colored blue. Just like before, Gero Gero's intestines were originally a gory red, making the depiction much more violent. Interesting to note here is that in both the Brady Games and Piggyback Interactive Official Strategy Guides, the boss is seen in its original Japanese form, perhaps indicating that the change was made late in the game's development. A very little known fact is that some special censorship was made exclusively for European versions, and it all revolves around Selfie, Final Fantasy VIII's hyperactive teen with a dream party member. This schoolgirl doesn't like to swing skipping ropes around, but instead deadly nunchaku. However, this caused the game to run into problems with a law that had been enacted in the United Kingdom around this time. Due to the rise in popularity of these weapons with football hooligans and other antisocial groups, extremely heavy restrictions were placed on their appearances in media. This saw nunchaku removed from games such as Soul Blade and even TV's Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Anyway, in Final Fantasy VIII's case, the censorship didn't see the weapon's actual physical appearance altered, but rather any references to the weapon by the Nunchaku name were changed to Shinobo, meaning Master Priest. Alongside the name being changed in numerous weapon magazines, you'll find the selfie's description is different when inflicted with the spell Scan. As you can see here, it's no longer Giant Nunchaku, but Giant Shinobo. But let's just finish up with one more fact about the spell scan, which is magic used to check up on both party members and enemy stats, and as well as the fun description entries allows you to manipulate the camera on a 3D model of the target. Although, did you know that there exists a big difference when you cast the spell on girls rather than guys? When viewing a female model, you're only able to rotate the camera horizontally, but for guys, you have absolute free control, enabling you to spin them on their head or do whatever you like. It seems that there was a concern over players manipulating the girls and peeking into certain private areas. This difference can be found in all regions and was done by the developer of their own accord, so it's not exactly censorship, but this act of removing some possible sexuality is certainly interesting to point out. Thanks for watching, guys. As always, thank you for watching. Sensor Gaming is the definitive resource for censorship, so make sure you've subscribed to stay up to date with the latest censorship in games. And if you guys like RPGs like Final Fantasy VIII, feel free to come on down to my channel, Avalanche Reviews, where I talk about RPGs and pretty much everything else.